Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Fallout 76 build showcase on the channel. In the last video, I showcased five amazing camps using pre-existing structures. As I said in the last video, I want to make this an ongoing series where I showcase and discuss other people's builds to help people get the recognition they deserve. If you haven't seen that video yet, I recommend you go check it out after this one. And if you are watching this and not yet subscribed to my channel, I recommend you do that too, so you don't miss any more of these amazing builds. In today's showcase, I'm going to be showing off some of the best and most imaginative builds I've seen so far. I would love to make a part two of this as well, so if you have a build or know of one which deserves to be shown, then drop me a comment down below. Or check the description for the Discord server where you can send me a message directly on there. Now if you do enjoy this video please be sure to leave me a like and if you are showcased or just enjoy the video that much please feel free to share it with your friends. So first up we have Sinister Hand who is notorious in the Fallout community especially the building one and his, this build is an 8080 out of Star Wars or an at at depending on how you prefer to pronounce it. This is one of the craziest builds I have seen in Fallout 76 and is definitely one of my favourites. It's so creative and crazy the way he's done it, like I honestly haven't got a clue how he managed to do this and like have a building there with no stairs going up or anything. But it's a perfect example of the type of builds he does that are absolutely crazy so I recommend you go check them out. Next up we have a swift kick in the nuts whose video went viral not so long ago, I think it was, wait, to be fair, it was about, about a year ago now, it was the early stages of Fallout 76, and he made this Deathclaw maze. This thing was all over all the social medias, everyone was sharing it about, and it is just crazy, like how he thought of doing this was insane, and how he got a Deathclaw in there is even crazier. I know you can get them as pets and stuff, but how it attacks everyone, I'm not entirely sure. But this build is insane, it's so imaginative and crazy, and the fact that he does it at all these low levels and clips them all in, it's really funny to watch. So if you haven't seen this video yet, I advise you go check it out. It's really brilliant, and he's got loads of other crazy ones, one including where he's catapulting a Brahmin at a target range, and it's just... Honestly, this guy just, I don't know how he comes up with the stuff he comes up with, but this build is absolutely amazing. It's not so much a camp in itself, but it is just in general a crazy build. So I hope you enjoy this one and go check it out if you do. Next up we have Ratty Star, who you will most likely know as he is a good friend of mine and we work together a lot. This build here is the Fallout Shelter Camp. Now I've never seen anyone else do anything like this bar a dollhouse which Final Render did and this build is really really good. The, it was such a clever idea to do, I've never actually heard of anyone mention doing this but the way he's done it is brilliant. I think that the building has four floors all kind of in line and working with each other. It's got all of the stuff you need on the bottom like water purifiers, the generators etc. Then on the top floors he's got bedrooms, dining areas, stuff like that and it's brilliant. At the next one we have Dragonborn McQueen, who is a small Fallout 76 streamer who I think you need to go check out. He streams every single day and it's really fun and entertaining to watch. Does absolutely all sorts, camp builds and just killing the Queen for the fun of it. This, this uh, clip that he's got here is based around K9 out of Doctor Who and I think he absolutely smashed it. Again, a really imaginative, brilliant build. It's really good the way it works and it literally, if you look at a picture of K9, it's very similar. I'm not going to show you inside though, so if you want to see the inside, go check out the video after this one. Let them know I sent you and I hope you enjoy it. I think it was a brilliant build and I think you absolutely smashed it out of the park. And then last but not least, we have Paragon Hex, who made this absolutely phenomenal fortress in Fallout 76. Now we did make this very early on in the game, so I would love to see another version of it, whether that's by himself or someone who is watching or someone else. I would love to see like an up-to-date fortress with all the new stuff that we've got in the game, because forests are just something that's really cool to build. I have, I've always wanted to build one in this game, I haven't built one yet, maybe I will in the future, but this is just a perfect example of the size of a camp that you can make in this game, and it works out brilliantly in my opinion. But yeah, like I say guys, if you want to try and do this, go for it. I think it would be brilliant to see some more designs of the fortress. 
and it'd be really cool to see so but go check him out as well as the others but that is it for five of the most craziest in the margin of builds i have found so far in fallout 76 as i said earlier on i would like to do a part two so if you've got any ideas of other camp builds uh, other examples that you know if you could tag them in or recommend them to me in the comment section down below or preferably if you would like to join the discord and send me some ideas over on there that would be awesome the link for that will be down in the description now before i end this video i want to say a quick thank you to each and every single one of you for the support that you guys have given me over the last god how long have i been doing this now it is it must be about two years can't be. It, it might, I think it's about two years now I've been doing this. It's gotta be. It's about two, 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 just over two years, I think. But yeah, just over two years, and we just smashed 2,000 subscribers. So thank you so much for everyone who has supported me along the way, given me help, supported by watching the videos, liking the videos, sharing them, commenting on them, whatever it is that you've done. Thank you so much, and thank you so much for watching this video as well. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button if you've got any ideas of videos or another top five so like top five i don't know most likely like homes type of thing the proper home camps realistic camps anything like that drop a comment down below in the description and i'll be sure to be working on them in the near future thank you so much for watching and i hope you all have a good day see you later guys and bye bye